Well, I would say the number one thing is make sure that you offer an inclusive service when it comes to web development. And what I mean by that is that, you know, sometimes clients, you know, we have to put in, you know, insert ourselves in that, in their shoes, right? And, and walk their walk with them alongside. Um, just like our partnership, you know, we consider clients partners as well. And that comes with a lot of responsibilities. Um, you counsel your clients. So it's developing that trust through education and, and, and different tactics that, you know, the, the more you get to share with them, the more they're going to trust, you know, the, the, the services that you're providing the more they're going to trust, you know, the, the, the enhancements that come along the way with growth. Because every client has an objective, you know, they have unique objectives, they have um, audiences that they want to reach. And you have to be mindful and intentional about that. So some tips to consider, number one, is know your client. And number two is make them aware of what they don't have and what they need in order to ensure that they're reaching as much people as they need to. And with that comes accessibility. 